Hey everyone, and welcome to Isms by Josie. Today I'm going to be continuing my unboxing from Barnail as well as Amazon. For my returning subscribers, thank you so much for tuning in. And for my new viewers, please consider subscribing, share, hit that like button, leave a comment below, and click on that notification bell for future videos. All right, you guys, I am just on an apology tour today because I'm just screwing it up left and right. Um, I accidentally um, timed my live to uh, a time that um, that Condrup Nails is doing her premiere, and I even said it in the last live if you were there. Um, oh, hi, Barbie. <laughs> If you just missed it, I just said I'm on an apology tour because I um, set my live to be the same time as Conjure Up Nails' um, video. I'm doing good. I mean, I could be doing better. I'm just totally screwing up today. I mean, I even got off of work late. Um, but how are you doing? I mean, I I know you um, also watch Conjure Up Nails' uh, videos. So, Feel free. I'm, you know me. I'm gonna be unboxing, so I'll be here. <laughs> but if you wanted to hop over to um, Conjure Up Nails, I feel so bad because, as I said last week, I have to make my lives earlier um, because I'm doing my treatment. I have to do meds in an hour. <laughs> so. Um, I thought I thought she was going to be on at five. I subtracted wrong. She's actually doing her premiere now. So that's good that you're doing good. I was hoping that maybe Dexter might join me so that when she watches the, this video, I'll be like, sorry. <laughs> but anyway, um, thank you for joining me. Since you're the only one here right now, um, Oh, okay. I'm looking forward to that. I'm always down for watching other people's hauls because this is a rarity. You know, this doesn't happen often. I just happen to get PR packages back to back, which is why I've been unboxing for like three lives now. Okay. Yeah. And I'm in a time crunch too. I have at most maybe half an hour and then have to get off to take my meds. But anyway, um, so thank you for joining me again tonight. You're just so awesome. Um, I really appreciate the support. Uh, I'm very looking forward to our little collab um, that we're going to be doing. Um, it's a bit exciting and it's kind of fun too because I always get kind of like anxiety um, when I'm spinning the wheel. I'm like, please don't land on this word. Please don't land on this word. And then, <laughs> and then sometimes it lands on it um and then i'm like darn it so then you have to like think oh my gosh what are we gonna do but um yeah i am gonna spin tonight and at least you guys have like the remaining uh couple weeks to figure it out um whereas in my case i have the day of to kind of figure it out <laughs> so um this is actually gonna be a breather for me to be able to think of something but sometimes the words are so stumpy. Like some of the words you guys give, I'm like, oh, I don't know, man. I hope I don't get that word. But yeah, so um, let's get to this stuff. Um, yeah, so I'm, I'm finishing up my care unboxing. I do have these things that I needed, and I thought it would be really fun to share. So. I wish there was like a huge wheel, like a color wheel of rhinestones that you can get that just have every color, not every color, but like primary colors already in there. And if you're wondering, I am actually watching <laughs> her premiere at the same time. But anyway, I needed yellow. So this is... Um, Oh, is this really good? So I actually, in my earlier videos, did all bling. Um, I was labeled the bling queen for a minute. 
but I was like, wow, I'm really using up my bling. So I stopped doing bling um, only when I feel like I need it. But I used to deck out like a whole nail with bling. So I have this. And the shape that I love, love, love right now, I'm going to show you, is this one because uh, it makes really nice like leaflets for some reason. I don't know, for some reason I like these leafy looking. So I'm actually working on a uh, press on set and I needed to get these. So um, I'm glad that I have them now. And there's been a bunch of times where I needed yellow and I didn't have it. So I'm glad that I have it. And for some reason, you always get one of these, which is fine for me because I live on these. These are like my number one important tool. Oh, but look, it's not sharp. My other ones are so pointy and these ones aren't, but that's okay. There's, they still do the same thing. Thanks. Yeah, I love rhinestones. Sometimes I don't like using it because I don't want to waste it. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. So in a giveaway, I did get these. They're wrapped and they're wrapped. That is like an overwrap. Too much wrap. But anyway, so I got these. But I... I got this one because I wanted this as well. And again, I'm going to use um, these leafy ones. Um, I'm going to do a uh, packing video so you'll be able to see the nails that I did, uh, the press on nails, but I'm not going to really show how I did them which is rare, like I normally film everything, but I needed to get these two sets out. I legit like did them um, this week. I still have to finish one. I love it. I didn't stop there. <laughs> There's more. <laughs> I ended up getting a, um, I couldn't find orange. So um, if you look on Amazon, there's like no orange. I think, uh, I think uh, <laughs> I told you I'm listening to uh, Conjure Up Nails video. I think she's playing Eminem on there. Anyway, um, I got the champagne color. I wish they had an orange, but they didn't. So, oh my gosh, this one doesn't have a leaf thing. <gasps> oh no. The other one that I do like, though, there's no leaf ones in here. That's not a good thing. But what I can use is this guy. That makes like nice leaves too. Oh man, I screwed up. Yeah, this one doesn't have, oh no, it's right here. It's mixed with other, with other shapes. That's why I didn't see it. Thank goodness, I only need a few of them. But the same shape, champagne color. Again, I wish they had orange. I know, and you know what? It's, I have, um, I had a mix. Uh, from years ago, and uh, I only have like one or two left, and it's a very pretty color. It's not that bad looking at all, really. So I know it's not a common color. That's probably why they don't really have it. Whoops. Okay, so I used up my tabs, as you saw last week. So I had to get new ones. I just didn't realize that I got, I thought I was getting one, but it came with two, three, four. Um, 
Um, well, at least you know I won't be running out today. Because I, I will do some swatching. Assuming that this mystery box has um, more polishes, which I can do. Okay. So finally, can you imagine that I got this like three weeks ago or whatever it was and um, I haven't opened it? <laughs> oh, unbelievable. Okay. Ta da! Oh my gosh, this box is heavy. Okay. What do we got? Solid gel polish instructions. I love solid gel, pat gel, paint gel. I'm all about this. We saw all those opals and um, Halloween colors. I it saves so, so much space and I think they last long. So I think I definitely want to switch to this. Okay, I'm assuming they put this in here because there's paint gels in here. I think there's a list on their website as to what what's in these boxes, but one, I don't remember. Two, I don't think I really pay attention to that stuff anyway. <laughs> Got my chocolate milk. Okay. Ooh, cat's eye magnetic gel. See, I feel like these two weren't in the last box. By the way, after watching Conjure Up Nails video, the two bottles that we saw last week, they're actually cat's eye gel. Um, that's how I did the the pink Halloween nail. I didn't realize this was cat's eye gel. And it doesn't say it on the bottle. And you saw me open the box. There's no, um, there's no, this thing. So I'm assuming that we have um, paint gels and cat's eye gels. Okay. Oh my gosh. Look. Oh my gosh, how cute. And look, they're like, um, raised embossed is this one like 3d 5d i don't know oh my gosh how cute these are so cute i find it funny that they even make stickers out of the factory information this is so cute 5d yeah i i'm not down with it i don't know <laughs> 5D, thank you. Um, okay, these are ir like a iridescent shiny, no, hollow, what am I saying? Hollow shiny roses. These are pretty. Not so much. This is the October mystery box. I, which is unfortunate because I don't think there's, they may have a few left, but I don't know if they're selling it anymore. But um, this is not really October. I would have picked like a um, a Black Eyed Susan, maybe, are those called? I don't know. Anyway, these are still pretty, though. I could totally use these for something. I never really liked stickers when I was using lacquer, because when you put stickers over lacquer, it's hard to, like, remove with just um, acetone. You have to get either, like, the super strength acetone, which is horrible, um, or you had to, like, scrape it off. But now, with the Power V file, I have no issue. <laughs> okay, more stickers. So as you know, I'm doing like a daily Halloween nail from this bar nail stuff. And now I just have more stuff to work with. I mean, what is this ghost, rainbow ghost? <laughs> but the wheels are turning on that one. I think I, I, think I know what I'm going to do with that one. Oh my gosh, no. I don't know if I can use this one. I might save it. <laughs> oh, 
and there's only one. That's the sad part. Oh, well. Okay. Ooh, butterflies. Okay. I love that. It's all red. I'm going to have to think about that one. Okay, next. An empty one. <laughs> These are super cute. Oh my gosh, there's a kitty on here. That is too cute. Oh my gosh, I love these. Ooh, look how pretty. It's like um, uh, a heart. It's a heart with bats. <laughs> how cute. Oh my gosh, no, stop it. <laughs> it's a ghost and it has a hat on and there's a like a little lantern bead sticking like it's a charm it's a dangly charm how cute is that oh my gosh i can't more drippy hearts i'm gonna have to change up from the the snail that i did with the droopy bleeding heart. It's a more simple version of it. I know. Yeah. I mean, they have some cute stuff. I like it's like a one-stop shop. The one thing that I didn't see there that I would want to see there is um like their own nail cleanser. Because I personally like using the nail cleanser as opposed to the alcohol. Because I, I don't know, it just smells better and I don't think it's as abrasive. I don't know. Anyway, oh my gosh, it comes in white and the hat is black. Oh my gosh. Same thing. Little dangly charm. So cute. Oh my gosh, I love it. Oh. I love how they're inverting the colors. So it's a light pink heart with silver bats on it. Very cute. Okay. Oh my gosh, look at that. Oh, by the way, I didn't know some of the stuff in the Halloween box was glow in the dark. I had no idea. Okay. It probably glows in the dark. I'll find out later. <laughs> but yeah, there were things in that th that in that uh Halloween box that was glow in the dark. Oh my gosh, so what is this? <laughs> they really like put some effort into this box. I really like that. Oh my gosh, there's more. <laughs> Oh, I could put these on my shelf. So cute. All right. These look like silicone pushers. Oh my gosh, I can't open it. They made it Josie proof. The struggle is real. <laughs> okay. At least you know it's tightly packed. This is just unacceptable. Okay. <laughs> yeah, they're silicone. Like, this is good for powders. Oh, never mind. I see this in here. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. And I like the silicone better than the makeup applicators because obviously you can clean this off. And then with the makeup applicators, once you use that for that color, unless you like wash it, you're stuck with that one. So they gave me three. And I'm guessing it goes with, ooh, solid pigment. It's like they knew. I see everybody using pigment. I don't have pigment. All right, 
one just not. Okay, yeah, I'm the ripper of boxes. I just tore that up. Oh, okay. Or maybe it's for this stuff? I don't know. Okay. So this is cool. I guess these are for this and the make, uh, makeup applicators for this. But these are pretty colors, so I can't wait to use them. But I don't know how I'm going to, like, I guess it's easy to incorporate these colors in a Halloween um, nail. But is this, like, eyeshadow? I mean, it's what I, it, I was just curious. Like, if I put this on my eye, would I totally be in big trouble, you know? Okay, I'll just use it for nails. <laughs> All right. Oh, my gosh. Look at this. I have my fan on, so maybe this isn't a smart idea, but I'm going to open it anyway. Oh, wow. Look at that. Super dark. I I think I, I, have a, I have a black, but it's hollow. This is just simple black, super tiny glitter. I guess you can do like sugaring with it. So I'm looking forward to using that and they have this this always reminds me of christmas it has um like a blue iridescent kind of sheen to it i don't know what i'm gonna do with this one this is this is more like christmas to me oh hi kim Sorry, I'm like opening away here. How are you doing? How is your night? Thank goodness it's Friday. Chop them up. Oh no, we have a loose charm here. It's a skull with crossbones. <laughs> I guess that's what was in this thing. Remember I said there was like an empty one? I think I chucked the bag. Oh no, it's right here. I guess this is where it was supposed to be. Because that's a random, random charm. Now it has a hole. Oh, here's another one. <laughs> but so far, so good. As long as the contents are in the box. Okay. <gasps> oh no, another one fell out. All right, now it's a problem. Skulls are flying out everywhere. Oh, there's a hole in the bag. I'm like putting these in over and over again and they're falling out. Okay. <laughs> Something's wrong with the video. All right, you get three. At least I think there's only three. Very cute. I don't know what I'm gonna do with them, but I'll figure it out. Then we have, I love these. Oh my gosh, this is, um, I just saw the movie and I just did the nail, this Oogie Boogie nail. <laughs> oh, what is his name? Oh my gosh, someone knows his name. You know what I mean? Jack? His name is Jack. Oh my gosh, help me. <laughs> this is so cute. I got a pumpkin. Top of my focus. Oh, these are the nightmare before Christmas. I mean, yeah. This is um <laughs> what's her name? Oh my gosh, I'm like tanking here. All right, this is not, I forget her name. The girl in the movie. You know, the girl. 
We have some coffins. Some ghosts. And oh my gosh, is this a vampire kitty? Or is this just a bat? I don't know what that is, but it looks super cute. <laughs> so funny. Okay. Is this just filler? Ooh, something's in here. Oh, it's a um. I can't speak today. It's a, uh, a damping dish. Look how nifty that is. How crazy. I love it. They really went all out on this box. I, I'm really impressed. And, you know, I've said last week or maybe the week before, um, I have never done a subscription box. And now that I have, um, drop a milk. Uh, now that I have, if I ever get another subscription box from another company, they're going to have to live up to the standard right now. All right. Elastic gem glue gel. Wow. My camera is really biting the dust. But it says elastic gem glue gel. No wipe jelly. This is interesting. Oh. All right. It's white. Nope, it's not white. <laughs> it's clear. Okay. I'm going to check the um, viscosity of it. Hey, Lena. How are you? It's Friday. So happy that it's Friday. I have glitter on here. Just opening my uh, mystery box from Barnell and the October mystery box. And it's, I've never had a mystery box before, but they're really, they really put some stuff in here. Okay. It's very jelly. I mean, it's not like soupy, so that's good. I don't know why the focus sucks on this tonight. But anyway, um... This is going to be good to use. I hope that it's as strong as my other stuff. So, we'll see. How are you doing, Lena? How's your Friday going? Yeah, I know you are always working. I actually got off late, um, which is rare. <laughs> So, and I was just telling um, Barbie in the beginning that I screwed up. I am pushing my lives earlier because I have to do my, I'm going through my treatment. So I have meds to take in like 30 minutes. <laughs> but um, I accidentally, uh, I thought I did the math right. I did it wrong. Color me that, right? Uh, anyway. <laughs> Uh, Conjure Up Nails has her premiere right now, and I feel so bad. You know, I'll try to, like, not put things on at the same time. But anyway. I bet. I, this weekend, today was rough for me. <laughs> I'm screwing up today a little bit. Um, other than that, I'm okay. I have my uh, chocolate milk, so I'm fine. <laughs> All right, so this is um, a liner. 
last week in the Halloween box. I thought I got the same thing. It's not, so that's great. I got the um, pool party, which was very blue and reflective. So this one is RGA03 Sparkly Violet. And I got my, I'm going to use my, my tabs because uh, last week I ran out on my live. <laughs> And uh, I can't be hopping on team to find those um, swatch wheels that you have, Lena, because I'd get in trouble. I'd get in trouble if, um, I'd get in trouble if I go on there. Yeah, I, I hope so. I just I just feel like I'm screwing up today because with work and everything. Oh. All right, let's watch the oh shoot. <laughs> I opened this, first of all, off camera. But I opened this. Look at did you see that? Oh, I wish like my camera. It's like it came off, it's like reflective silver, but you can see the purple through it. So it tripped me out there for a second when I opened it. I was like, whoa, it looked like a strobe light for a second and it looks all silver on camera. Oh, so sad. Like how do you, how does anybody do these um, filming? I guess to get like a real camera and record, but like then how do you uh, transfer how do you transfer your, I guess it's easy to upload a, a video from your camera to the laptop. But then if you do a live, how do you, um, uh, how come I can't speak? How, how do you, <laughs> oh Lord help me. How do you film on camera during a live and upload it to the internet? I'm just not. I'm not that, uh, oh, maybe I should show it, right? So you can see the purple now. I guess now that's on a, it's really a purple on my end. <laughs> but it has that really reflective silver, which is probably why this whole crap isn't focusing because it's, it's too glittery. Look at that. I'm totally into the reflective glitters. Um, well, I'm into glitters, period. <laughs> hey, pint size power. <laughs> I've been saying it so wrong all this time, I feel. How are you doing? <laughs> I saw you on Conjure Up Nails in this vi video. I, think I'm not the I, you know what? Yeah, I should probably do the live through YouTube. The only problem is I do it through StreamYard so that I'm able to have the uh, the two things going on here. So that's the only thing. Yeah, you know. I, I try to be there for everybody, <laughs> and I'm failing miserably. All right, so these are the paint gels. Lena, uh, when you get the chance um, to watch back to the charms that they gave, because um, they're just so super cute. It's They had some cat kitties, like the stickers. Um, they had some really cute stuff. But yeah, I mean, this is the part three, I guess, of the unboxing for Varnail. And um, they really did their work. I really love what they packed in this box. And this is all Conjure Up Nails' fault. She, <laughs> she introduced me to Varnail, and now I can't stop. Oh, oh yeah, I forgot. These um, come with easy pull-out tabs. 
love that. Yeah, because I don't like when it's the metal and then you have to like dig into it. Yeah, yep, we all know that because I am so behind this week. I'm not going to lie. I was watching, I did a Saw Marathon <laughs> and I was totally watching that like Monday trickled on to Tuesday and then to do the, um, the Oogie Boogie now, I watched uh, The Nightmare Before Christmas again. So uh, I wasn't able to watch the YouTube, like I watch YouTube videos between Monday and Friday while I work. <laughs> I'll try to watch some on the weekend, but it's really tough for me to do. So um, that's why I'm so behind. Well, I normally am not this behind. This is, um, this is behind. Cause my, my uh, comment, page has like so many comments from you guys and i i haven't been able to reply back yet and i don't reply till i watch the videos so Ooh. oh i didn't even read the color you can't even see it uh this is number 49 strobe flake and i love it it looks glitter af <laughs> and i love like i said earlier i love paint gels because they just glide on and this is what it's looking like it's not even like normal glitter it's like chunky shards of glitter it's like someone just took a mylar balloon and just cut it with micro scissors <laughs> Oh, I love my descriptions. Like, they probably make no sense. But to me, they make all the sense in the world. <laughs> oh. Anyway. Oh, thanks, Linda. I know, right? Oh, some days I'm like, don't be watching anything else. Just watch videos. Sit down and watch freaking videos. Because when you get backlogged, it's very um, immobilizing. Like, I look at my list. I'm like, oh, no. I can't. All right. This one is Deep Red Brown. I love Deep Red Brown. I need more of it. And tis the season too. It's like a fall color. Look at that. Nice. Um, it does not look like chocolate. <laughs> Which is a good thing. Because then I'll think about wanting to eat it. But anyway. Yeah. Yeah. But it's good though. Like when I have nothing else to do. I'll. Uh, I'll, uh, whatchamacallit, watch videos. So at least there's always something to do. You know what's bad is when I have, like, this is my new phone. I didn't like um, T-Mobile. I was a Sprint person, and then they, I got switched over to T-Mobile, and they just started to suck, so I switched to Verizon. Not that they're any better, but <laughs> I got a, a new phone, and I have my old phone that's recording here. So what's crazy is when like I um, I watch two videos at once. That's when it gets a little nuts because I'm trying to like crunch it down when I'm like backlogged. The only thing is, um, you know, and I do this while I work. Oh crap! I got myself. <laughs> um, I do this while I work, so it gets a little crazy sometimes. Like trying to remember what happened in the video in the beginning or end. So sometimes I end up rewatching it. <laughs> and then if it gets a little too crazy, I, no joke, will play it like 
two, three times. And I'm like, listen, you need to stop. You need to pay attention. <laughs> oh my God. Anyway. All right, this one is not rubbing on so great. Well, I love the color. I just think you would probably have to do two coats of this because it's coming on a little translucent. You know, I used to be a super fan of the color maroon, and this is kind of giving me that vibe. I mean, it's brown, but it's also red, and I don't think you could see that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Sprint used to be great. I used to love Sprint. I never had an issue with them. What T-Mobile did to me, they kept me on some sort of... I bought my phone uh, before T-Mobile bought them. And so I was under contract. My con my contract was over. Hold on, what am I doing? It was over. And they, uh, they didn't let me know. They just kept me paying the monthly because i financed the phone which i don't know why i do that like i should have just paid it all at once i paid the new one all at once because i'm not i'm not doing that again but like i told them why didn't you let me know oh we sent you an email i'm like ah first of all <sighs> i have a lot of emails that i don't read but for sure i don't get like t-mobile emails i did not see that at all so there was just no way they sent me that email. But that's what they do. They um, bank, oh, this one is number 7373 neon red. And it is very neon-y. Um, so that's what they do. They like uh, bank on people not checking their email and they just keep charging you the monthly for the phone after you've paid it. Like I was done paying with that phone for a long, I was cursed, <laughs> a long time. And I said, um, you need to go talk to your manager and you need to reimburse me for the money that I've been paying after I finished paying the phone. Otherwise I'm switching to Verizon. And he didn't call me back. Nothing was ever done, so I switched. Okay. This almost looks like... Hold on, I'm going to cure this. <laughs> this almost looks like the one that they gave me in the, in the Halloween mystery box. Oh, yeah, I can't even tell you how long I was. I was. I said that too. I was like, I've been a loyal, you know, Sprint customer since whatever year I said, and still they didn't do anything. It does look orange. It's a little bit of red, but they gave me in the Halloween mystery box. They gave me this uh, neon orange. And this is, this is really orange. So I guess this is their orange red. So we'll see what I'll do with that. I got more gels in this box. The Halloween box had what, like four? And then I got some free ones. This one here is number 44, dark purple. Did you hear that? <laughs> and some more. That also, not about nails, but that also reminds me, um, I did the same thing to Bank of America, by the way. I was a 
customer with Bank of America when it was fleet. And um, during the pandemic, like I was laid off during the pandemic. So um, I didn't have money coming in and they charge you. If you don't have a minimum in there and if you don't have a direct deposit going in every month, then they charge you like 25 bucks. And um, I have other accounts, but I was like, listen, I, I was with you guys forever. Can't you just hold off the fees? I mean, we're in a pandemic. <laughs> they, have, they put it off for like two months or something like that. So after two months, I called them up and I said, I'm, I want to cancel my account because I, you know, you're going to charge me the fee and almost a lot of, you know, I don't know who's out of the job, but there are a lot of people that are out of the job and you're going to charge me. So I have, uh, I had and still have had back then and have had have have um capital one and they've been great they don't charge me anything but you have to get the right checking account if you don't have 360 i think you're charged if you don't keep a minimum and, or keep uh, direct deposits in there <sighs> yes purple i love purple that one kind of reminded me of a great even though I'm kidding. <laughs> yeah, this country is nuts sometimes. Like, I just don't understand the thinking, but, you know, it's because they want your damn money. <sighs> Ooh, what you get, Lena? Anything good? Now we have more gems. Gems, gems, gems. This is CECB03, and it's called Firefly, which is funny because when you say Firefly, I think red. But we'll see. Oh, and this is the Crystal Ball Cat Eye. All right, thank you for that. I was explaining earlier how last unboxing, I got these two. And then when I saw Conjure Up Nails in this video, she had different colors, but she was using them as cat's eye. And I'm like, oh, that's interesting. So I was like, let me check if these are cat's eye. These are cat's eye. And my tabs are wrong because with cat's eye, I will do um, a swatch of the cat's eye magnet thing. And then I'll, I'll show you when I do this one. But I was like, oh, how cool is that? I didn't know. So in my Halloween um, mystery box, I think these were the two free ones, though. They weren't part of the, the Halloween box. In the Halloween box, um, oh my gosh, I just lost my train of thought. <laughs> oh, I didn't know that things glowed in the dark, too. So there were things in this in those boxes, in this whole thing that I don't know. And, and looking at some of the charms, I'm not too sure if some of them or none of them are going to glow in the dark. But anyway. Um, oh my goodness gracious. There's Lena. Lena. Just ice. Well, ice is good. Look at this green. It's metallic. And it's cat's eye. So someone knew. Someone knew. This is pretty. I'm like getting the chills. This is very pretty. Okay, so when I do swatching for cat's eye, I do the. Uh... Oh no, where did I put my magnets? I hope there's one nearby. I think I put it away. Ah. All right, pardon my armpit, people. See how everything is all magnet and stuck together? Okay. All right. Ah. 
So I do one of these. I did you see that? I do see that. Yo, bro. <laughs> Am I the only one going insane here? Okay. Okay, so that's that. That was pretty, wasn't it? Yeah, it was super gorgeous. I want to do like a witch out of this one. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Okay, and then I'm gonna pass it over again on the on the tab so that you can see the color be uh, behind the the cat's eye. And then we have this one. So yeah, I gotta take my med in nine. So, good thing this is the last item. <sighs> I hate being on schedules. <laughs> okay. So, this is a gel polish. It's called Star Glaze. Ooh. This almost looks like the pool one from last week. My goodness gracious, I think textures. It's very reflective -y. Oh, buddy. My texture's not feeling well. All right. So, yeah, I do the cat's eye and then I do this over it. Oh my gosh, Dexter. Are you okay? I think he's coughing up the hairball. Oh, I didn't show you. So you can kind of see the color behind the color, behind the cat's eye. So pretty though. Anyway. Okay. I know uh, there was a time, and I asked the vet this. I said, is he doing this on purpose sometimes because he wants food? But he, I feed him twice a day. And at one point, it was like, okay, I'm not going to lie. It was like a can, like a little mini can. And the doctor's like, oh, you know, he's okay in weight, but we want him to not gain anymore. So you should cut his food in half. So he asked me when I feed him, how much I feed him. And he's like, okay, so yeah, just keep that, just half it. So I give him half a can. And in the beginning, he wasn't getting used to it. Like he wants food, a freaking piglet. And um, he would vomit and there would be no hair. I have to like, thank you. I'm gonna have to like <laughs> clean up and stuff. But um, they wouldn't have any hair. And I said, is there something wrong with him? You know, they did all the tests and stuff, and he's fine. It's like uh, just monitor it. If he did, if he does it like way too often, then let us know. And he just eventually like he only did it for a little. So I was like, that's weird. But we thought, we said, like I straight up said, I think he's doing it because he, he knows that that gets my attention. And like I end up babying him or giving him a treat later or something. So I think it's because he wants food. Well, I think I see a hairball. So <laughs> I think that's a hairball situation. Oh, he always does it. It's, it's not that common anymore, but when he does it, I swear, he does it at the worst time. <laughs> All right, so six minutes to spare and I have to clean vomit anyway. <laughs> but yeah, um, I am just carrying that last swatch, but you guys, this is what they gave me in my mystery uh, October box. And it's just a mystery October box. Like they really packed it. I'm very impressed. It makes me want to like do more of these, but that's not gonna happen. <laughs> I mean, at least not often. Who knows? 
it might happen again. I don't, I'm not too sure. When I do Born Pretty, it's usually just five stuff. So um, I'm just laying this out because these are just so cute. I'm glad I'm finally done like unboxing all of these. I only had it in my possession for like three weeks without touching it. Oh, look at that. Oh my gosh. Again, like the reflectivity is screwing up with the with the, the zoom, with the focus. This is really nice. So all of this has to end up in my Halloween nails somehow. So Oh, that's too funny. I swear, I, yeah, I think. He's a smart cat. He knows, he knows what to do, when to do, how to do it. Okay, so again, like I said earlier, like, I think they're discontinuing the October box. Um, I saw something in the, in the mail, in the email, in the email. <laughs> um, I saw that they were uh, closing out on the October box, which is silly. It's like first week of October. But you can go check on there and see if they still have it. But these are like in these cute. AF charms. Yeah, I don't know what I'm doing. There's not enough room. <laughs> and then the stickers. I mean, you guys. I'm just going to pass these through. Thank you. Oh, my goodness gracious. <laughs> now he's going crazy with the litter box. So we had a little bit of everything <laughs> today. We have the unboxing, we have Dexter puking out, and then we have him now scratching away in his litter box. Anywho, all right, you guys. Yeah, pets are just something else. It is a lot. It's just crazy, a lot. And um, like I said, I think I'm going to be good with my Halloween nails for this. <laughs> but I'm very impressed. If you want a subscription box worthwhile, definitely um, check them out. And then if I get any, I get like 25% off if you use the discount code. And then I'll definitely let you guys know if they have any extra sales on top of that. But I am happy that I unboxed everything now. It was like waiting for Christmas three times. <laughs> but um, anyways, thank you so much, you guys, for joining me tonight. Um, this is probably good that it's short. But I also have to sleep early, too, now, which is, like, crazy because I, I like staying up. Like, even, like, the other night, I, I did kind of sleep a little late. Like, I think I went to bed, like, at midnight. Because I was just watching. Like, I just can't help it. But anyways, thank you so much for joining me tonight. I hope you guys have a really good weekend. Um, it's gloomy over here, but it's always nice inside. So I'm sure I'll have a good weekend myself. And then I'll see you guys next time. Oh, and I guess for everybody, um, I'll, I'll have to message Barbie and you know later. Um, with uh, the spinning stuff. So, but thank you so much. I'll see you next week. Yes. Oh, you know, if I'm done with my snuggles. Yeah, I know it's awful. Like, and I dread it too. Oof. Okay. Thank you. You have a good night and weekend as well. All right. I'll see you guys. Thank you so much. Bye.